Welcome to my video about diatomaceous earth and how it can be used as a pet food additive. Diatomaceous earth is a naturally occurring silica that is deadly to pests. It is used as a deworming agent for animals and it can also kill fleas, ticks, and mites by dehydrating them. Diatomaceous earth is highly uh, absorbent of water. It's also slightly abrasive on a micro level, so it will kill fleas and ticks and mites by basically breaking them apart and dehydrating them. And to mix it into your pet's food, here's how you do it. You will want to start small. I would recommend only one tablespoon of diatomaceous earth per three cups. Luckily, I happen to have a container here that is almost exactly three cups. It's just a little bit over. And so you fill it up to the to the lip here. That's three cups, and it leaves a little space for you to be able to shake it and mix it. And that's how you do it. You basically just, what I do is I fill it halfway, and then I put the DE in, and then I fill the rest of it up with cat food, and then I mix it up. I personally like to shake. Some people mix. I like to shake. And uh, and then you feed it to your cat as per normal. And it, it does a great job of uh, protecting them from pest outbreaks. You can hear her in the background. I have a cat. Her name is Zara. She's actually considered special needs because she's very allergic to uh, fleas, ticks, and mites. And this stuff has been a godsend because it's only about a dollar a pound, which is a lot cheaper than the stuff you get from the vet. And, uh, I, by the way, uh, make sure to get food-grade diatomaceous earth instead of uh, industrial or pool-grade. Sorry, stop that. She's a little nervous because I'm not paying attention to her. But, but yeah, you, you'll want to use the food-grade stuff. And, obviously, I'm not a veterinarian. I'm not a biologist. Uh, just a quick disclaimer. Uh, do your own research, but I'm just showing you how I do it. And uh, you can tell that my stuff here looks a little bit white. That's because I use more than what I'm recommending to you. But I would definitely start small with just the one teaspoon here. So do that, and uh, your home will be generally pest-free. I mean, this stuff works amazingly well.